And over on Dwarf Fortress here, I'm just going to view the fortress by moving around. You see, it follows the camera now. Welcome to Dwarf Fortress and welcome to the channel I am Twisted Logic. We are going to take a look at Stone Sense. So I'm going to type in STO and then click Stone Sense. Now this is going to launch a 3D isometric visualizer. And if we scroll down in this before we click enter, then we have a bunch of uh, instructions, the controls here. Okay, and we have some known issues down here as well. And so the thing about Stone Sense is sometimes it does crash and crash out the game. But it, let's launch it. Okay, so I have Dwarf Fortress on the left and Stone Sense Isometric View on the right. I'm going to click on to Stone Sense. Okay, and then using the greater than key, I'm going to zoom in a little bit. Just like that. Back over on Dwarf Fortress, I'm going to hit Escape. And now I'm on Stone Sense here, I'm going to click on Stone Sense and press Shift F. Okay, we got Shift F enabled on Stone Sense. And over on Dwarf Fortress here, I'm just going to view the fortress by moving around. You see, it follows the camera now. So let's come up in the layers. Uh, there's an armor stand with some armor on it. We got bedrooms here. Excellent. Now you see, I'm not touching anything in Stone Sense. I can adjust the view if I want to zoom out a little bit. Maybe the less than key. Just like that. And look, we're looking at uh, some bedrooms here. Uh, we got some a lot of graves. <laughs> uh, yeah, a lot of graves here. And then here's the library with the pump stacks. I think these pumps look pretty awesome in the isometric view. Let's zoom in on those. Oh, wow. We can get in pretty close with the with the isometric view here of Stone Sense. Let's zoom out. Maybe two. And then, oh, okay. So they got to put all these scrolls away. Nope, somebody broke all my bookcases. <laughs> we have our swimming pool here. And it's even displaying the designations here for the Roman numerals, which I think is pretty awesome. Alright, let's zoom out a little bit in Dwarf Fortress. That doesn't affect the zoom of Stone Sense here. And now you see these two dwarves right here. Uh, we got uh, Itar and Feb. And if I unpause the game, uh, now you can see them moving around in Stone Sense as well. So what a lot of people do is they have two monitors and they put Stone Sense on one and Dwarf Fortress on the other one. And this is our main entrance area here that's still being worked on. Uh, we got fortifications all around the side. And this is our main Dwarven entrance. Up one layer. This is our Atom Smasher outside and we can see our our fortress here is uh, of Tullinabash is an island. And this is the top of the obsidian farm. So this is a pressure reservoir for the water that speeds up the quenching of all the magma to create obsidian in this obsidian farm. And we have our magma gun over here. Oh, the power supplies look pretty cool too. Uh, then we have our Dwarven shotgun right here that comes down and over to the shotgun barrel. And we have our hospital and workshop area as well as a couple of guild spaces and libraries on this level. Uh, this is all water controls for the whole fortress over here. This is the water works. So we can pump out uh, right here. We have the ocean drain right here. And um, this right here is for the canal fish trap that we currently have open. Uh, let's take a look at the units list. Uh, we got a horseshoe crab on the map somewhere. Oh, way over here. Okay. He looks kind of cool. Let's zoom in on the horseshoe crab. Oh, right there on the on the ramp there. <laughs> He's getting cut off a little bit by the ramp. I like how you can see kind of into the water here um, a little bit because this is the main entryway for the water coming into the fortress right here. Uh, this is the U-pipe that we're looking at now. Uh, it's a little bit hard to tell what we're seeing here. I do I do like Stone Sense a lot. However, I'm really waiting for Armok Vision to come out. Armok Vision is so much better than, than Stone Sense, although I, I really love Stone Sense. Thank you very much for watching and subscribe for more videos. Thank <laughs> you.